it's Sarah, and I just got the other Troll Beads bracelet. I figured I'd film it. Um, I did just do a video, so I have black paint on my fingers, and um, that'll be coming soon. I just antiqued my other steampunk box. But anyway, what I did was I got, okay, Troll Beads is kind of, um, it's a collectible way to go if you like jewelry, and that's what I like about it because you can get different lengths of chain, different locks to put on the chain, which is the clasp, and then you can get all different beads to create your bracelet. So it's it's just super fun, and I really enjoy it. I have nothing to do with troll beads, but I just like it, and I know a lot of you guys out there do too. Also, um, yard work yesterday. Sorry, I have a blister. Um, I ordered the Art to Go bracelet, and on my last share, I told you that... Um, this one was starting to get a little tight. I ordered the 7.1, and that includes the lock. The length includes the lock. So if you go like this, 7.1, okay? And that's a good size for me, but when you add the glass beads, they, they're they dimensional, so they hold the bracelet away from your actual measurement. It's up higher, so the more you put on, the tighter the bracelet gets, so I was debating either stop getting beads, which that's probably not going to happen, <laughs> or get a longer length. So they had a bracelet called, and here's how it comes in this box, called Art to Go. And of course, I love art. That's right up my alley. And so I ordered it. It's $99, um, and you get a complete bracelet. Because you can get everything separately, they have a couple different items that you can get as um, a set. So you get this chain part, which is $45 normally, a lock, which is I think around $45, so that brings it to $90 right there, right? And then you get a glass bead, and I ordered the green one. I'll come in. My hands are bad. I'm sorry. I ordered, I just said you had a choice of color, so I ordered green because I just didn't have any. And this is what I got. It's kind of like they must paint with glass as well because that doesn't look like it's just paint. It looks like it's glass that they've painted on there and it has little dimensional knobby things on it. So it's super cute. I should have done, I should do this in the sunlight. But anyway, then this is what I was telling you. So this is like a tube of paint and it's actually squirting out paint at the top. Here it is. Here's the, the tube. And it's like got paint squirts coming out the top to make the lock. It's a couple of bottles. Oh, this one goes down. So this one squirts around the bottom. And then it, I ordered the 7.5 inch length of chain because I'm going to switch it out. And then you also get this little silver charm, which is a paintbrush. And I think it's supposed to be like two pencils. So super cute. A lot of nice silver presents. And I like it. So what I want to do, though, is just change. I'm going to put, keep this one being my um, my artist one. So let me show you what I'm going to do. Anyway, so this is what I'm saying is, you know what I'm saying. It's not that complicated. I'm going to take the lock off. So now I have two lengths of chain. One is going to be longer than the other, see? So I want to take the longer one, and I'm going to put that with my heart lock. And I'm going to take the shorter one and make this just, this is my art bracelet. But I also order, oh, because when I ordered it, you got a free bead. I think if you spent a hundred, it was a hundred and something. I didn't quite make it, but you know, so I ordered another bead. So I'll show you what I got. You got a free bead if you ordered a hundred and something. So this is the one I ordered. OMG. Gorge. It looks like it has a blue core, and then they painted the purple. I'll come in. Oop, too close. It's like a peacock feather, kind of, in purples, and then there's like a gold stripe going down the middle. It's gorge. I really like that one. But I want to add that to my other bracelet. And then this was the free one. I think it's called like, let's see, I have the paper here. <clears throat> Strawberry Stripes. So it's a little bit of reds. 
a little bit of yellow and like a kind of a creamy core so I mean <clears throat> it goes doesn't really go with the theme I have going so I'm gonna put that on my art to go bracelet and this is the shorter length and then I'm gonna hold me go back up because I don't want to I'm gonna hook my um, clasp on here my nails I'm sorry this is bad I have paint on me but I was too excited I washed my hands Anyhow, all right, so this should be 7.1 now. Yeah, it's a little, like this lock might be a tiny bit bigger than that lock. That's the thing. I think this is like all handmade and stuff. So this should be the longer length. Yes. Okay, good. So I just want to, and I'm going to put this on. I'll show you because if you don't have that many beads, it'll fit me fine. But when I start adding more beads, it gets too um, tight. All right, so I need to put some stuff on here. Let's see. I'm going to go with, I'm just going to start going. I have two spacers, which are silicone spacers. I'm going to put this in the middle. I'm going to put that in the middle. This at the end, spacer. Just have to push it through the silicone. And then I'm going to put these in the middle with my heart. Another spacer. I really think before I order any more, I'm going to go to a store. Because I think I want to get a couple of rocks. They have like actual um, rocks like pyrite. Um, aquamarine I don't know like all the different actual I mean amethyst would probably be a good one for this one specifically because I'm kind of working with purples I think I don't know I like it the way it is all right so then you could put your clasp you kind of put the smaller lock on this side this is the so they don't fall off and then I'll show you the difference in um size my I have no nails I'm so sorry okay good so let's see this is now on the six and a half it should be and this is the 6.1 yep definitely shorter so that worked out but all I did was switch the length of chain because I want to be able to um have I have more on here so let's see how it fits so I'm just going to put them both on um my right wrist so it's going to take me a sec so this is now a 7.5 but it has a lot of beads on it I think four glass beads oh yeah I can clasp it myself oh that feels good and things can roll around it's a little long still but I have a feeling the more I add it's going to get um, tighter now this is the 7.1 in the art to go and um, oh I can do it see when it has fewer beads on it it doesn't it's not so tight I mean I wish I could show you how it is to clasp it but I can manage it on my own now when I was wearing this shorter version I couldn't get it done with this many beads on my own it was really hard but now let's see so the 7.5 is definitely still bigger and the 7.1 obviously is is um smaller but I feel like this is just with the more beads it's better and this is good so I'm excited I like it I'm very happy all right you guys and like so like I said um I have nothing to do with troll beads but I just wanted to share because I do I have done a couple of jewelry um oh look and then this was one other thing so with the art to go bracelet I think this is like a little coloring book I want to see this and this was free it came with it and I asked for a catalog but they don't send me a catalog oh these are it's not a book let's see they're just little cards oh this is cute oh they're all of the troll beads designs because you know they have I think they have the people's bead see this is what the um, art to go clasp looks like it's a tube 
of paint. So someone designs this, you know. Um, they have a, I think a competition or something where you can design your beads. So this is good inspiration. So this is what someone would do. They would just draw the different designs. Like this is cute. Look at this one. Wow, this is cool. So these are all the designs and I know they have unique beads. Maybe those are ones that got messed up or something. Boy, these are pretty intricate little drawings. So anywho, oh, this is a leather bracelet. It's just a plain one. This one's a little more jazzed up with like some um, Zentangle in there. So anyway, that's nice. So this is the Art to Go bracelet. They just put a heart one on there. But see, there's the little paintbrush. Isn't that cute? Anyway, so like I said, I have nothing to do with it. I just love to collect things, and I love color, so it makes me happy. And all my jewelry got stolen, so I'm kind of replacing it little by little. Um, so, all right, that's it, you guys. And you always get a little, um, these are awesome, too, these uh, polishing cloths. They really, really help. I actually uh, cleaned mine recently. So, again, 7.5, 7.1. 7.5 still big so that's good because like I said I want to have room to grow and it's not too big all right anywho I'm excited that's it you guys thanks for watching